Guys, today is finally the day. I'm just going over the last preparations for the trip to Ireland. And tonight we're gonna to start the long drive, which is like a four hour drive to Pembroke in the south of Wales, then three hour ferry crossing at 2.30 a.m., landing in Ireland tomorrow morning super early, driving the five hours to the west coast. We are walking through a village in Ireland with all our stuff. to uh, create this next episode of the Kingdoms Project. You can watch the first episode in the link below the video on my YouTube channel. Caught in the act on my YouTube channel. All right, we're off to a very unsmooth start so far. Sam's forgotten his passport. It looks like we might miss the first ferry. If we miss the first ferry, we might miss the second ferry. There's a storm coming and we, we're chasing the storm now. It's not the smoothest start to a trip I've ever had. Hi there, how are you? Uh, I've actually got two bookings tonight, one for a freight van, um, but they, I think they're gonna be maybe late. Oh, he's forgotten his passport. Yes, that's the one, yeah. I'll put them on the next one if they turn up in time. Uh, amazing. Thank you so much, much appreciated. Ross has forgotten his passport as well. Uh, so he's now definitely gonna miss this ferry. He's then gonna have to get the next ferry, which isn't until nine o'clock because it's Sunday, which means he's not gonna be on the mainland until 10, which means he will only make the ferry to Ireland by half an hour. Yeah, half. If he races and doesn't stop all the way up there. If his van can do 70. And his van is so old. I literally put my finger through the back door the other day. No way. <laughs> you picking the lot? It's quite hard to organise a free ride trip. Man. Skin of our teeth. Here we go. This is the crossing. It's basically getting absolutely annihilated. It's going to be an interesting week. Okay, that's fun and done. For future reference, you need 46 PSI in the back tire of a fully loaded Caddy Maxi and 42 PSI in the front. And they come standard as 34, so if you're doing a long drive, just make sure you top up that pressure. We're in Pembrokeshire at the Irish Ferries Terminal. We made it this far. Hi, Tim Port. It's Tom Court, Love indeed. Two adults travelling. Yes. It's so windy, dude. Oh my god. Yeah, so we've gone Pembroke to Fishguard. That was a brutal crossing. A super rough, wavy, really hard to sleep. Um, but we're here, we made it to Ireland. Wind is pumping, waves are pumping. We know because we've just been in it. Coffee's on. Oh, you're coming over for surfing, are you? Yeah. Okay. yeah. Filming and surfing and fun. All yeah. right, okay. Okay, first spot chosen on the map and uh, we're gonna go straight there. 12 minutes from the ferry port. Wendy, wind is not a problem, that is for sure. Island explorers, let's go. Dude, we need to get those on for the search. For the search, the extra tusks. Oh, yeah, look at those things. Yeah, buddy. For the mission. Two minutes off the ferry, we're running up the coast. Wow. So I put into the sat nav that, that, that reef then. What's it called? Oh, should, I, should I drop a pin? Come in, Rusty Spoon. Come in, Rusty Spoon. Where are we headed? I think we're going west. Get out, get 
Yeah, get a good step on and then stop for some breakfast and have a little chat then. Okay, breakfast spot stop. Oh, there's a kite up, no way. Kite already up. We are literally 30 seconds away from seeing the sea here on the west coast of Ireland. I can already see a kite. It's a good sign. Awesome, mate. There are some massive humps around. Okay, we are straight into a session. By the looks of it, I haven't even had a chance to check the spot, but it looks good. We see a point break just down over there. Reeling left-hander, side offshore. Looks like you could kite and wing it, so I'm gonna take both sets of gear. And wing session on the cards. Mate, this is looking fun. Literally only 24 hours later, we are walking through a village in Ireland with all our stuff. How good. Six meter dice, SLS rigged, is looking like a very sketchy launch spot straight off the bat. So I'm not quite sure this is how it's even gonna work. Gusty. Cliffs, rocks. So always wind up your lines when you're launching from a rocky spot so that you don't catch them in the rocks. Well, in case there's a rip or something, you know. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold, just hold it there, Scott. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah, good. So far, so good. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Oh, Slavid. Slavon. I'm gonna take the wing. There's two uh, 
on shore for the boat. Yeah, boy. Yeah, it's a good place to do it. Straight in, Ross. Straight in again to an absolute banger. How <laughs> was it? Yeah, it's pretty sick, man. Good day. <laughs>